Hey guys, Flooding Mod 14 here, and we're back with some more of this. This is Let's Play Yu Gi Oh! Nightmare Troubadour. Alright, let's do it, guys. Alright, so last time we uh, successfully used our uh, final deck, and we actually found out the Destiny Board bonus has like a hundred points. Uh, but as you can see on the left here, we have Yu Gi solving the Millennium Puzzle. So today I think we're going to head to the shop and we're going to try some more of the dual puzzles there. Uh, we're going to basically do all the intermediate ones. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys don't mind, but uh, basically I'll try them all, you know, myself, you know, for a couple times, see if I can figure them, figure them out. And if I can't for whatever reason, I did uh, uh, get the solutions, uh, you know, saved uh, kind of in a PDF. So. Yeah, let's go to puzzles and intermediate and the steel squad. Let's do it. Let's see. I'm sure we can figure these out. All right. Yeah, a little something different for you guys. So winning this turn. Yeah, that is the goal. Okay. Let's see. What do we got here? Uh, vengeful box spirit and stumbling. I see. I see. Well, uh, it seems like we're gonna have to uh, chain energy as well. Hmm. So I can only play three cards. Uh, well, okay, well, first of all, I think we're gonna have to destroy Stumbling no matter what. So I guess I will use Swarm of Locusts on this. Yeah, first. Uh, what else do we have here, by the way? What else is face down? Uh, okay, we got Stealth Bird, Stealth Bird, and Swarm of Locusts. Okay, well, I guess let's just do this damage with Stealth Bird and go from there and see if we can figure anything else out. So, 1,000 damage. 1,000 damage. Okay. There we go. So, we really only need to do 2,000 damage. Um, I guess we'll flip the second Swarm of Locusts to do... Uh, to take out Vengeful Box Spirit. Hmm. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that, though. I just realized we have Shield and Sword in hand. Ah, it might be... Okay, so let, let's see if I'm 500 short. If I'm 500 short, then I know I need to wait on the Locust. On the second Locust. On the second Locust. But let's just try this. Let's try Shield and Sword, because I'm pretty sure that's what you gotta do here. Yeah, because this Giant Soldier's got too much defense. Uh, this is at 2,000. Uh, now, doesn't this have an effect? Yeah. On your side of the field, Beast, Warrior, and Wing Beast get piercing. Ah, okay. So, we could boost uh, one of the birds and get do 100 damage. But if we use Block Attack on uh, Aquamador right there, we should be able to do more damage. Yeah, so we should be able to do... Uh, like 500 damage due to... Yeah, so let's try and Rage Battle Locks. Okay, and that's the last card I can play. So, again, yeah, let's see if I'm 500 short, and if I am, I know, like, I just need to do the same thing, but, um... Wait on the Swarm, uh, the second Swarm of Locus. Okay, so, Enrage Battle Ox, attack Garuzis here. I don't think it really matters what order you do this in, uh, as far as attacking, because they all have, a. Uh, Right, they all have piercing now, and, um, uh, yeah, so it, it, the order really doesn't matter, but there you go, so that takes down that, so like I said, let's see if we're 500 short, if I, if we are, then I know what to do, that's 400, mm, yep, yep, gonna be 500 short, okay, okay, so we got this one figured out, just need to, uh, make sure I wait on the second Swarm of Locusts, so not a problem, not a problem. And I do want to flip the Stealth Birds first, though. Yep, so we're 400 short. Let's uh, surrender and try again. Yeah, we'll surrender. Not a problem. Not a problem. We got this one, guys. We got this one. All right. They throw you a lot of options there, though. Sorry, incorrect. Try again. All right, Grandpa, no problem. We got it. We've got it figured out. Win in this turn. Yeah, so... Swarm of Locusts. Gotta destroy Stumbling first, because that switches us to defense. 
So, yep. Destroy Stumbling. Uh-huh. Yep. Looking good. Boom. Alright, and then flip the Stealth Birds. Don't flip the second Swarm of Locusts yet. Alright, alright. So this one's a little tricky, but it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Second Stealth Bird will do a thousand damage. Alright. Now we want to play Shield and Sword. Okay. Go! Shield and Sword! Hehe! <laughs> Offensive Defensive Flip! And now you have to have Swarm of Locusts take out Vengeful Bog Spirit, otherwise you can't attack, so there's that. And uh, what did I do last time? Block Attack the Mador? Yeah, Block Attack the Mador. Alright, Block Attack. Yeah, they throw you a lot of different solutions here, like Sword of Dark Destruction to boost one of the Stealth Birds, and uh, Mysterious Puppeteer to get around the life points as well, but... Nah, this appears to be the way, just straight up, you know, just use, basically, use Enraged Battle Locks uh, to the utmost. Okay, so you take out Garuzis. Alright. There we go. And we just attack with everything, and that should be it. Alright. I like the music in the Dual Puzzles, by the way. Uh, but yeah, how are you guys doing today? Uh, today is June 27th, uh, 2022. Ah, July 4th's coming up, yeah. So, uh, yeah, happy July 4th to you guys. Actually, well, by the time you see this episode, July 4th's probably gonna be long, long gone by the time you see this episode. Uh, but, uh, yeah, let me know in the comments, uh, what you did for 4th of July this year, or what you're gonna do, what you're gonna do. Uh, what we usually do is, uh, usually every year, like, we live right across, uh, next door to, uh, some apartments. So, in the apartments next door, they always have a bunch of, congratulations, you're correct. Thank you, Grandpa. But in the apartments next door, they always have a fireworks show, a, a small one, you know. And then at, at the church down the street, they have one, uh, it seems like, almost right after. So usually we just watch the one across the street, you know, we do some cooking of our own, then go down down the street to the church and watch that one. And then after that, uh, we usually drive to like the, uh, the rich part of town, uh, up on the hills, and uh, then we watch them uh, use all their fireworks. We normally don't buy too many ourselves. We'll buy like eh, maybe a handful of model, model rockets, but like our thing uh, with our family, like we've always just, you know, and I guess it's just kind of smart, and it does save a lot of money, because fireworks are expensive, and gas is really high right now, man. But, uh, yeah, we just usually watch everyone else use their money. Pretty good, pretty good strategy, right? <laughs> you know, and we just, you know, yeah, just enjoy the time we have, you know? So, yeah, that's what we do, but, uh, let me know what you guys are doing. Ah, you know, if you've got the extra to spend, I don't blame you if you'd like to, you know, buy a few of the fancier fireworks, but, uh, anyway... Break the spell. Let's do it. Let's see if we can figure this one out. Okay, so our life points are at 2250. Interesting. Uh, what's he got here? Oh, wow. Curse of Darkness, huh? Um, yeah, each time a spell is activated, controller takes a thousand. Okay, well, we've got nothing but spells here. Um, wow, he's only got a hundred points? What? Interesting. Uh, well, I'm pretty sure no matter what, we've got a Mystic Space Typhoon in that card. Yeah, the controller of that spell takes a thousand. I mean, I'm pretty sure, but let's see. Increase, okay. Increase both your and your opponent's points? Huh. Interesting. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's just, um... Uh, Wait a second, Megamorph. Megamorph. Let me let me just think here real quick. While our life points are lower than our opponents. Oh, I see. I see. Huh? Maybe we don't want to use Mystic Space Typhoon. Okay, yeah, because the only solution we have to get over this is um, we've got to use Megamorph. 
so let's try blue medicine. Now, unfortunately, this works on our opponent, too, but... Yeah, I guess let's try blue medicine. So we take the 1,000, and we gain 400. Ah, I see. Wait, wait, wait. He didn't gain 400? Wait, 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 wait. He's both your and your opponent's... Wait, he didn't gain the 400. Okay, well, we might be okay here then let me think now I could activate another blue medicine oh or I could activate mystic walk because see right now nothing's in the graveyard hmm and all we need to do is a hundred so megamorph will double shadow a goal to 3200 so I think oh wait 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 fairy meteor crush don't have piercing either. Hmm, I gotta think on this one. So, so I'm trying to make our life points 50, 50 exact. So if I play blue medicine, that would give us 50. No, that would give us 20. Let's just try blue medicine again. I think I think this is the right solution, because this would give us Right. 1050. Okay, now if we play one more spell, we'll take the damage. But we'll have 50 points. So I think now's when you want to play Mystical Space Typhoon. I think. Yeah, so that'll do that. Okay, now that's off the field. Okay. Now I think you just want to play everything from your hand. So, Megamorph on Shadow Rule. This one's tricky. This one's tricky. Because you have to use Megamorph. Okay. Fairy Meter Crush, because you have to do Piercing as well. Right, right. And I'm guessing Mystic Walk... We'll let us select attack points on Unhappy Maiden. Because we need Shadow Ghoul's effect for the extra hundred. So Mystic Walk. Get rid of that. Attack. So we gain nothing. But that's good, because we stay at 32 with the Megamorph boost. And then Shadow Ghoul's own effect puts us at 3300. Ah! Very tricky, very tricky. I like that one, though. I like that one. Because I, th I thought right away, I was just like, yeah, just Mystic Space Typhoon. We can play all our spells, no problem. But, no, the key there, you have to, I guess you have to activate the blue medicines. And I guess the blue medicines are glitched in this game. Because they didn't boost his life points. Um, but, yeah, I guess do it in the order I did it. The blue medicines first, then Mystic Space Typhoon. Leave yourself with exactly 50. Use Mystic Walk to get her in the graveyard and don't boost your life points at all. So, interesting, very interesting one. Congratulations, you're correct. Thanks, Grandpa. Just my type? Question mark? Hmm, interesting. Let's try it. Oh boy, a lot of cards, a lot of cards. Win in this turn. Okay. So that's on Valkyrion. Dang, man, that thing has 40. Wow, he has full life points. He has 8,000. Holy crap. Okay. This one might take us a while. Uh, we got two Taylor of the Fickle. Interesting. So we got two Taylor of the Fickle. Okay. And we also got two field cards. Limiter. Mm, I see. Limiter removal. So one of these DNA surgeries we want to change this to machines. Huh. We also have no... This is tricky. This is very tricky. Okay, well... S I don't think Sogan's gonna help here. Um... I really don't think it's gonna help. So... I'm gonna go with Mystic Plasma Zone. Let's just try it. Let's just start trying, guys. So, let's go with Mystic Plasma Zone. Now, I think what you have to do first is, uh, because we've got 8,000 points too, so Sword of Dragon Soul, a Dragon-type 
that battles us is destroyed at the end of the battle phase. Okay. So, first DNA surgery. Um, change to warrior. Okay. Um, okay. So, there's that. I guess Taylor the Fickle, huh? I guess let's steal his, um, Sword of Deep Seated? That makes sense to me. So, steal Sword of Deep Seated, put it on... I'm thinking we go with Ryukushin for the, for the finish bonus. So, put it on Ryukushin Power. Okay. So... Okay. Uh, cause we need to play limiter removal too is the thing. So let's have this on... Let's have this on Thunder Dragon, the weaker one. Okay, and I guess let's play... Let's play Acts of Despair. I'm trying to figure out how we're gonna do the... the the 8,000, man. I guess we'll put Axe of Despair. We'll try that on Ryukushin Powered as well. Okay. Alright, so let's just see if this works, first of all. So, Thunder Dragon destroys Valkyrion. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I just, I just realized we made a misplay. we did because in order to destroy it he has to have a dragon type monster oh I didn't think about that so hmm. would this work well let's just let's just test this equip would this work if I change it to dragon I wonder let's try it. Uh, dragon Oh, it doesn't work. Okay. So... Hmm. So no matter what, you can't use Sword of Dragon Soul, it seems. Not, not in this duel. You can't really use it. Interesting. Well, that's good to know that I tried that first. Okay, okay. Well, we'll surrender from here. So I don't think we can take out Valkyrion. Uh, no matter what we do. No, I don't think so. So... Basically, you can't use Sword of Dragon Soul. So, hmm, interesting. So I wonder how you get past Valkyrion, then. Just my type. Hmm, we might have to look up the solution for this one, not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Yep, winning this turn. Okay, so this card's out, so don't have to worry about that. Um... I guess we can try limiter removal before before I go all in here. Huh. I guess so, yeah. Um Yeah, cause 4300. I'm pretty sure you have to steal his equip no matter what. I'm pretty sure about that. Let's just try this. Let's try DNA surgery. Let's try um, machine. Okay, because that'll let us play limiter removal whenever we want. Uh, Mystic plasma zone. Okay. There we go. Um, but why do they give you two DNA surgeries? I think that's what's throwing me off. It's like, why do they give you two? And neither one of these are warrior. Like, I can't... Right, this is Thunder. This is Fiend. So I can't equip this... before... and then change him to Dragon. That, that doesn't seem possible. So... I guess we'll do... Taylor of the Fickle. Steal his equip. 
Switch to Ryukushin power, okay. So there's that. Um, and... Hmm. Oh yeah, good point, but how's, how's Thunder Dragon gonna get over? Huh. of despair on I guess on Thunder Dragon here I guess and they're both machine now hmm limit removal now okay so now they're both at 5200 hmm So now, Thunder Dragon attacks this. Hmm, but how are we gonna do the extra damage? That's what I'm wondering. So you, you can't get rid of Valkyrion pretty easily here. And, well, I guess we still have Taylor of the Fickle, so I guess Taylor of the Fickle can switch Acts of Despair to this. Okay, so that puts it at 6,200 we got. Um, I don't know. Hmm. Oh, wait, this is something I just thought of, actually. Something I just thought of. Okay. So... What if you switch to Warrior now? Can you equip it? And Main Phase 2, I wonder. Yeah, you can. Okay, I think I might have a solution for this one. It's gonna be a complicated one, but I think we can do it. Okay. Huh. Okay. So, just my type. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. So, hmm, yeah, winning this turn. Um, maybe we can try to, uh, yeah, DNA surgery. Maybe we can equip this and, um, basically make the most of limit removal, maybe. So, let me just try this. Let's see if this works. Change everything to warrior. Warrior. Okay. Taylor of the Pickle, still his equip. Uh, yeah, still yours. Uh, Ryukushin power. Okay. Um. And we have two field cards, too. Yeah, is the thing. Okay, let's try this. Let's try a Sogan. Because that'll boost everything. I'm not sure if this is gonna work or not, but we'll give it a try. Uh, Sogan to... So let me think. 18 doubled would be 36. He's got 3850. Okay, let's give the sword to... Um, Ryukish... I mean, uh, Thunder Dragon. So now it's at 25. Um... And you're at 23. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Uh, Acts of Despair. Acts of Despair onto Thunder Dragon. Okay. Uh, Taylor of the Fickle. Doesn't matter, I just need this card off the field at this point. So, Taylor of the Fickle can switch Acts of Despair to, uh, to Thunder Dragon again. Let's see. Acts of Despair to Thunder Dragon again. Oh, no. Okay, well, I guess we'll switch it to Ryukushin Power. 
and then let's see if this works. This is the main thing I was wondering. It's like, if I switch this to machine and like use limiter removal right away, I wonder if it'll boost uh, Thunder Dragon Steel. So, machine. Oh no, it takes it off right away. Okay. Uh, well, in that case, I'm not really too sure what to do here. I guess we might have to look up the solution for this one. Not a problem, because, yeah, I'm honestly stumped. Lemon removal... Yeah, because even with all that, I'm still at 7,200, so... Huh. Well, I guess we'll surrender there. Yeah, I guess we'll surrender on that one, and, um... Yeah, I guess I'll look up the solution to this one. And we will continue it in the next one. Sorry about that, guys. But, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks all for watching, and I'll see you all here in just a little bit.